Well, before it uh, rains, uh, it's been rumbling kind of on and off the last 20 minutes. There is the brand new Charlie, or Charlie Creek, Woodwind Acres Pond Dock. Uh, actually, uh, it uh, is really quite solid. It's built on uh, four 30 inch ground spikes, of course. And if you can see underneath the front, since it has a three foot overhang from the last post, I decided to do an angle brace on it. So it's nice and solid and it's not going to bend anywhere. Uh, there are the two Samson posts, and yes, they're level. Uh, pardon me, and plumb, a little bug just landed on me. Um, and if you need to, I engineered it so if you needed for me to put a little step down for ease of kayak entry and exit, I can do that without a problem. But uh, it uh, functions very well. Uh, everything lined up just the way, you know, measure three times, cut once but uh, it uh, should function pretty good. I'll take a walk on here and you actually extend over the water quite a bit. But before I do that, I wanted to show you the cleaned out area that was filled with all a bunch of debris that other people had left. And maybe even me, I'm not sure, but I raked it all out up until you can see the, that tree line right there. Anything beyond that uh, is just all natural, but boy, did it clean up qu quite well. Uh, just really pretty and I took it all the way to that fence post right there. So there are a couple of rocks. Uh, boy, that freeze, breeze feels really well, really good, pardon me. Uh, but there you have a nice little open area, and if you wanted to put a bench or a picnic bench or a ta picnic table or whatever, you can still do that. But uh, here is the walkway now, pardon me, the dock, and I'm standing on it, really very solid. And now you can overlook. I'm over the creek by about three feet. And it looks uh, very nice. Our little aer aeration system is working well. Uh, there was no scum on the pond this morning. It was all kind of pretty. Uh, it's getting nice and breezy here. Oh boy, does that feel good. But I uh, just finished fertilizing and insecticiding. Insecticiding? Uh, whatever, a bug be gone. All the uh, entire bell curve and this whole area here by the dock and fertilize this whole area just with a light fertilizer about half of its normal volume uh, August is when it gets its regular one but uh, again I'm standing on the new dock area and the Samson posts Samson posts I'll go underneath here are secured with three screws that you can see there I think there you go and they're three inch screws, so they're really solid. You can tie up just about anything you want there. And there's your three screws. Uh, when I was working on it, there was all sorts of little uh, froggies inside, just kind of swimming around underneath the water. So they might provide food for you know other big fish. A couple of big fish jumped out again, but uh, what are you gonna do? So anyhow, there's the dock, and I'll walk back. And you can see, that's the only hose or pipe that sticks out now. All that white piping back there is gone and uh, not to be forgotten. And for some reason, I, th I just think that the pond fill pipe uh, push out, pushes out more water. It's probably just an optical illusion, but uh, it works fine. It's all glued and I covered using the mulch from a whole bunch of shredding that I did over there. But uh, there's your pond. And I'll turn around here and get the full effect. I also had a little bit of time, but not much, to clean that tree just to the left of the gate. There was a bunch of dead branches. I probably could even take out more, but it just got too cumbersome. And I need to work on the uh, trailer next. So anyhow, I'm gonna walk down now and show you the other side of the dock. And there is exactly, I think, 10 feet, 3 inches. There's your four foot extension at the end. Uh, everything lined up pretty well. I had, uh, there was a rock or something underneath, so I think the frame underneath there is out of square by maybe a half an inch. I'm <laughs> not really sure. But uh, I think it will function really well.
be surprised if it doesn't rain, but so far we're just getting, there's another view of it, getting a lot of noise. So there you go. There's the cleaned out section right behind the, the dock. And here is the pond. One last view. And that's it at Woodwind Acres Pond.